General Hospital spoilers reveal Cyrus Renault Jeff Kober may have killed Sam McCall Kelly Monaco, and for reasons that will make heads spin. For four years, Lulu Falconeri, Alexa Havens, has been in a coma healing from side effects caused by being trapped in the explosion that Cyrus caused at the floating rib. Sure, Julian Jerome, William Devry, planted the bomb, but it was on Cyrus' order. Although Cyrus could never predict that his niece would wake up now, he claims he has turned over a new leaf in finding the Lord and wants to do whatever he can to help his family. In his mind, that could mean taking Sam out of the equation so that Dant Falconeri, Dominic Zampragna, is free to go back to Lulu when she does wake up, if she ever did. Is that what happened here? The autopsy report shows that Sam was poisoned by an overdose of a heart medication called Digitalis. Since Sam didn't have a heart condition, it's going to cause quite a stir that the hospital allowed administration of such to her. Alexis Davis, Nancy Lee Gron, may be likely to file a lawsuit, and everyone who loved Sam is going to question how this could have happened under head nurse Elizabeth Baldwin's Rebecca Herbst. Watch. If no employee on staff under her gave Sam this drug, then who was able to slip into her room and do it, and when? All of these years, Cyrus has watched as Dante Valconeri, Dominic Zampragna, moved on from Lulu, and the hope that they would ever be able to reunite as a family or a couple. While all of Lulu's family understood, given that he and Lulu weren't even together anymore at the time of the explosion, Cyrus may take it as quite the insult to his niece, whom he has grown so oddly fond of. Despite the fact that he's the reason she's in that hospital bed, maybe he feels like he owes her some sort of compensation. He did cause her to lose four years of her life, after all. Is he looking for ways to give that life back to her? When Dante clearly decided that Lulu was his past and Sam was his future, maybe that's all that Cyrus needed to know to push him to take matters into his own hands. Killing Sam certainly puts things into perspective. Christina Corinthos Davis, Kate Mancy, pointed it out so clearly that had Sam been more selfish and not donated her liver, Dante would be burying Lulu right now instead of Sam. Did Cyrus play God and decide to kill Sam so that she would be out the way and the path for reunion between Lulu and Dante would be paved? He couldn't have known that Lulu would wake up so soon, but that doesn't mean he didn't want to clear the decks for her. He likely believes it's his way of making up for what he has done, attening for his sins. Is he that far gone that he thinks the Lord would approve of his alleged mercy killing? The world of General Hospital is buzzing with speculation after a series of cryptic developments that suggest Cyrus Renault might have targeted Sam McCall in a shocking move to set things right for Lulu Spencer. This theory has sent shockwaves through the fan base, with many questioning whether Cyrus, known for his villainous schemes, could take such drastic measures, and if so, what his motives might be. The possibility raises a myriad of questions about the tangled relationships hidden agendas, and dark secrets that define life in Port Charles. Cyrus Renault, played masterfully by Jeff Kober, has been one of the most menacing and enigmatic villains in General Hospital history. His tenure has been marked by calculated manipulation, deadly alliances, and a penchant for holding grudges. While Cyrus was recently presumed to have undergone a spiritual transformation, his actions suggest that his old ways may not be entirely behind him. Could his latest scheme involve avenging Lulu by targeting Sam? To unpack this theory, we must first consider the history between Cyrus Lulu and the broader circle of Port Charles residents. Lulu Spencer, portrayed by M. Relin, has been in a long-standing coma following a traumatic explosion orchestrated by Cyrus. Though Cyrus claimed remorse for his role in her fate, his sincerity has always been suspect. His connection to Laura Collins, Lulu's mother, adds another layer of complexity. Laura, who shares a strained familial tie with Cyrus, has often been a target of his schemes, and her bond with Lulu remains one of her greatest vulnerabilities. Lulu's absence has left a void in several lives, particularly Dant Falconeri, her former husband, and Maxie Jones, her best friend. Dante has been working to move forward, building a relationship with Sam McCall, but this budding romance has not been without its complications. Sam, a strong and resourceful private investigator, has been central to Dante's healing journey, yet their relationship has faced challenges stemming from their respective pasts. 
If Cyrus indeed orchestrated Sam's death or disappearance, it raises the question of his motives. Would Cyrus view this act as a way to by clearing the path for her potential return to Dante's life? The twisted logic would not be out of character for Cyrus, whose plans often defy conventional morality. His desire to earn Laura's forgiveness or to re-establish a connection with his estranged family could also factor into such a scheme. The theory gains traction when we examine recent events on General Hospital. Sam has found herself increasingly entangled in dangerous situations, particularly those involving Cyrus's renewed presence in Port Charles. After seemingly turning over a new leaf, Cyrus has re-emerged with cryptic warnings and veiled threats. His interactions with Laura and other key players suggest that his intentions remain far from pure. In the weeks leading up to Sam's alleged demise, tensions between Cyrus and Dante have been escalating. Dante's role as a detective and his determination to protect those he loves have put him squarely in Cyrus's crosshairs. If Cyrus perceives Sam as an obstacle to Dante's reunion with Lulu or as leverage against Laura, his targeting of Sam could be seen as a strategic move. For fans, the idea of Sam meeting a tragic end is both devastating and shocking. Kelly Monaco has portrayed Sam McCall with unwavering charisma and depth since 2003, making her one of the show's most beloved characters. Her journey from a con artist to a devoted mother and skilled investigator has been marked by resilience and growth. Sam's relationships, particularly with Jason Morgan and later Dante Falconeri, have been central to her storyline, endearing her to audiences worldwide. The possibility of Sam's death also raises questions about the future of her family, including her children, Danny and Scout. How would they cope with such a loss, and what role might Jason or Dante play in their lives moving forward? The ripple effects of Sam's absence would undoubtedly be felt throughout Port Charles, impacting characters like Alexis Davis, her mother, and Molly Lansing Davis, her sister. If Cyrus is indeed responsible for Sam's fate, his actions would mark a significant turning point in his character arc. While he has attempted to present himself as a man seeking redemption, his involvement in such a heinous act would confirm that his transformation is little more than a facade. This revelation could set the stage for a dramatic showdown between Cyrus and the Corinthos family, as well as Laura, Dante, and other key figures in Port Charles. One potential twist in this storyline is the possibility that Sam's death is not as it seems. Soap operas are known for their penchant for fake-outs, where characters presumed dead later resurface under dramatic circumstances. Could Sam have gone into hiding, faked her own death, or been secretly held captive by Cyrus? These possibilities would open the door for an eventual rescue mission or a shocking return, adding layers of suspense and intrigue to the narrative. The impact of such a storyline on Dant cannot be understated. As someone who has already endured significant loss, Dant's reaction to Sam's presumed death would be both heartbreaking and transformative. It could reignite his unresolved feelings for Lulu, creating a love triangle fraught with tension and emotional complexity. Alternatively, Dant's grief could drive him to seek justice, putting him on a collision course with Cyrus that would have explosive consequences. Meanwhile, Laura's role in this unfolding drama would be pivotal. As someone who has repeatedly stood up to Cyrus and fought to protect her family, Laura would likely take an active role in uncovering the truth about Sam's fate. Her efforts to hold Cyrus accountable could bring her closer to uncovering his true motives, further deepening the conflict between them. Maxie Jones, another close friend of Lulu's, could also play a significant role in this storyline. Maxie's sharp instincts and determination to protect those she loves make her a formidable ally. Her involvement in the investigation could bring her into Cyrus's orbit, placing her in danger and raising the stakes even higher. The idea of Cyrus targeting Sam to make amends for Lulu raises broader questions about redemption and the lengths people will go to in pursuit of forgiveness. While Cyrus's actions are unlikely to win him the acceptance he seeks, they underscore the complexities of his character and his relationships with those around him. As the storyline unfolds, fans will be watching closely for clues about Sam's fate and Cyrus's next moves. Whether this theory proves true or serves as a red herring, it's clear that General Hospital continues to deliver the twists and turns that have made it a beloved staple of daytime television. 
Stay tuned for more updates and spoilers as this gripping storyline develops. In the unpredictable world of Port Charles, anything is possible. And the truth about Cyrus, Sam, and Lulu may be more shocking than anyone could imagine.